So your Fortnite settings look like absolute dog water after the last Fortnite update being Fortnite Chapter 3 and you want to take it from this to something way better. Well, thankfully we do have a fix on this channel. Of course, Fortnite Hub is a place for everything right now Fortnite Chapter 3 related. We're trying to cover everything that you might need to see. Now, if your graphics were actually pretty decent or at least not an issue back before Fortnite Chapter 3, there may be something wrong with your game. Now, let's jump through the different possible options that you may want to use in order to get through this. The first one is actually being in-game itself. So if your in-game looks like this, then generally it should be fine. But if it doesn't look like this and you don't know why, go to your top left and you'll see here an icon. Click on this icon and you'll find here it is a different settings menu. This, of course, used to be in the top right, but now it's in the top left. And of course, the entire user interface looks different. We're going to jump and navigate through it, though. So obviously you can party up, you can refer a friend, you can find your friends list, and of course you can add friends you can use your mic settings i assume but if we go to the bottom left we will see a menu screen the menu screen then takes us to settings reporting feedback code of conduct support legal credits etc settings on the top is the place to be and then you can of course go through different settings on the game what we're looking at right now is not the display settings, it's the, not the graphic settings, it's the graphics quality. Now these are optimized for my personal streaming setup, but obviously whatever works for you. The main important setting that you want to click and you don't know, have to worry about sort of matching every single one of these. In fact, do not match this to what you have on your computer because it may not work for you. If you click on the auto set quality and then click on this right here, I've already done it so there's no need for me to do it, but your computer will determine what sort of settings you need or Fortnite I should say will determine what sort of settings you need considering your computer's resources. So click on auto set and that should get you a better option as far as the graphics are concerned. Now. If this doesn't work for you, the other option actually is quite simple and interesting because this seems to be a fix for a couple of things I've noticed now. See, when Fortnite Chapter 3 first started, it was the most players Fortnite had seen on any season ever. Incredible results for Fortnite Chapter 3. But on that note, if you were playing during the time, you'll know that you weren't able to get into the game. There was literally too many players and the service could not handle it, so you had to go through a queue time, only oftentimes to be finding that you can't even get in and to be told to try again later. Now, what many people did, including myself actually not expecting it to work, was going through to the Epic Games launcher and verifying the Fortnite application. In order to do this, you go into the Epic launcher and then you go down to the bottom three right hand dots and you will see right there that there is an option to verify. What this does is essentially it makes sure that Epic Games launcher is verifying your game files, which means if you have any correct game files, Hopefully it should fix those in time for you when you launch up on Fortnite Chapter 3. And hopefully these two options, which again is the auto setting and the verifying of your computer Fortnite game files is incredibly important. With that being said, hopefully this helps. If it does, like as always, much appreciated. Make sure to subscribe to the channel for more information on Fortnite Chapter 3. Have a great day. See you in the next video.